Yo, what's good kings and queens? It's your boy Don and I'm back for another reaction video today If you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button Hit that notification bell and hit all so you know every time I post you heard If you're not new to the channel, thank you for popping back out Thank you for continuously showing love I appreciate y'all you heard Yeah, today we got a great video Please make sure y'all go down below Put y'all social media so I can pin somebody you heard Yo, we're going to be reacting to the 10 weirdest prisons you won't believe exist. I don't know really what to expect. If y'all seen the show, what is it called? Like 60 Days in, some crap like that. Whatever it's called, you know what I'm talking about. It's on Netflix and Hulu. I'm guessing it's going to be something like that, like where it's like mad dirty and like they just need to fix it up or whatever. I don't know what to expect. I'm not going to lie. If y'all know something or y'all know what to expect, please let me know down in the comments if you saw this video. If y'all want to see me react to something else like this as well, please let me know you are. Other than that, please follow on my social media. Let's get right into the video, you are. ...boring places. But it turns out around the world, there are some truly bizarre prisons you'd never believe existed. Oh, From like Alcatraz. Where you have to pay for your own cell to prisons with luxury restaurants inside them, and even a prison where the inmates have fun all day, every day. Let's take a look at some of the best, worst, and frankly weirdest prisons in the world. Cebu Prison, Philippines. Cebu Prison is a rehabilitation prison. This means you'll go to it in the hopes that you'll turn from bad to good. I think However, that's what all prisons are, right? Maximum security, meaning that some of the people in here have done terrible things. The weird thing is, the main way they rehabilitate you is through dance. Right. Every day, all of the prisoners have to gather in the courtyard. They then have to perform a gigantic dance routine. These performances are filmed and released online, and this has caused the prisoners to have lots of fans. They're right. basically online celebrities, even though they can't use the internet themselves while in prison. The so thriller paid, dance though. released in 2007 has gone on to become one of the most viral videos of all time. It's estimated it's been viewed over 200 million times. In each Where of these dances, that? over 1,500 prisoners participate. And amazingly, these go well every single time and there's no big incidents. This is despite the fact that 50% of the inmates in the prison have taken lives. Conditions around the prison are very harsh and strict. And the only way to get out is to participate in these gigantic dance right. routines. Basically. San Pedro Prison, Bolivia. San Pedro Prison can be found in Bolivia's largest main city, La Paz. Inside are 3,000 very dangerous inmates. The weird thing about this prison is when you're sentenced here, you need to pay for entry. You then need to buy your prison cell. This creates big inequalities inside the prison. The cheaper cells are in very poor conditions. In the terrible cheap cells, there are three or four prisoners crammed inside a tiny space. But the more expensive cells are very fancy apartment blocks and even houses. These are normally bought by businessmen and politicians who've been sentenced to jail time. Many complain and say it's very unfair that rich criminals get great treatment, while poor criminals do not. How you feel about that? It seems like some inmates are getting less justice than others. If you find How you feel about that? Nah, that's... One of these. All you... I'm not gonna lie, in the mission, please make sure you go down below. Hit that like button if you haven't, that subscribe button and that notification bell and hit all. Go down to the comments, yo. Let me know what y'all want me to react to, but... Based on what we just saw, how y'all feel about that? Like... The prisoners get to live way better if they got more money, if they could afford it. They got to buy they sell. How y'all feel? Let me know down in the comments, you heard? Nah, this um commercial dead got me. I'm not going to lie. But make sure y'all go like, comment, subscribe down below. Let me know what other videos y'all want me to react to, too, you heard? Other than that, let's get back into the video. I want to hear what else they're going to say. But at least with this prison, you don't need to be separated from your family. The wives and children of many inmates actually live with their husbands inside the prison. When you've paid to get into the prison, don't think you're getting a free ride. Inside San Pedro Prison, nothing comes for free. Every inmate must earn their living, so they work in shops and restaurants inside the prison. Also, there are barely any prison guards inside San Pedro. Unlike most prisons, guards rarely enter the main part of the prison. This means that the inmates are left to look after themselves. Basically. It's basically a small community locked away. 
Some prisoners take this way too far and even make their own narco labs. They then sell this say. illegal product inside the prison and even sneak it outside. And this helps them pay for the nicer cells, which are like apartments and houses. Right. Sark Prison. I was going to say, they probably still going crazy. This prison is located on the tiny island of Guernsey. This is found in between England and France. The island's only prison is named Sark Prison, and it's the smallest in the world. It's made what? of stone and is very old. If Must you're a tourist, have you're actually allowed to walk around this prison outside, but it is still in use. There are only two guards at Sark Prison. It's normally oh, wow. only used to sober up someone who's being drunken and disorderly. Guernsey Island only has a population of around 500 people, and it was built all the way back in 1856. Pinel de Ciudad Barrios, El Salvador. Wow. This prison is okay. one of the scariest in El Salvador. El Salvador is known for its very high rates of crime. And much of this crime comes from the Mara Salvatrucha. This is a gang also known as MS-13. Right. This notorious street gang has been left to run this prison. Inside, these cells are 15 square meters and 3 meters high. Inside, these tiny cells are upwards of 70 people. The prison is very overcrowded as it was only built to hold 800 people. But today, there's more than 3,000 inmates. The prisoners are so feared that the guards pretty much leave them to run it themselves. Inside the prison is a bakery, workshops, a hospital, and even a rehab clinic. This is all controlled by the inmates, and they basically run their own mini-society locked away from the rest of the world. Wow. Forteza Medicia Prison, Italy. Italy is famous for its delicious foods, but you may not expect that even its prisons have incredibly fine food. Inside this Italian prison is a four-star restaurant. The meals inside the prison are made by the inmates themselves. Many of these people are mafia members who are serving life in prison for taking lives. Mm. To make things even more strange, regular, law-abiding citizens sometimes enter this prison for a meal. It's known mm. as being such a good restaurant, people even go on dates here. They don't what? sit in the same prison cafeteria as the normal inmates. But instead, they're getting served by those inmates. It must be pretty scary knowing that your pizza is being served by a mafia boss. The food mm. has great reviews and is said to be excellent. But mm. if I were you, I would not send any food back. A mafia mm. boss may take offense and things could go very bad. Oh, uh, I don't think so. Bastoy Prison, Norway. Bastoy is an island located 50 miles off the uh, coast of Norway's capital city, Oslo. Crazy. The only thing on the island is a prison, which is known as the Penthouse of Prisons. It has incredibly low security, and inmates can roam around freely. It's also the first ecological prison in the world, using only solar panels for energy. Wow. Many of the prisoners have committed the worst crimes known to man. But despite this, they live in luxury conditions. This may sound crazy, but the numbers show that it works. Almost none of these people reoffend when they come back out. Okay. Almost none of these people reoffend if they're released. And Norway as a country has the lowest reoffending rate in all of Europe. Nice. So while it may seem strange to treat such nasty people in such a nice way, maybe it actually works. I'm sure Squirrel it does. Treating jail, anybody nice. USA. The squirrel cage jail can be found in Iowa, USA. It has one of the most unusual designs for a prison ever. From the outside, it looks like a totally normal jail, but uh -huh. inside are various revolving cells. These were designed with the intent of having maximum security with minimum jailer attention. There wow. just needs to be one jailer sitting at the center of this circular rotating structure. They don't need to walk around at all and can keep an eye on all of the prisoners at once. Cerezo wow. Chitumal, Mexico. This unique prison can be found on the border of Mexico and Belize. Despite many Mexican prisons being very dangerous, this one is not. In fact, they've had no incidents in the prison for years. Okay, the nice. prison guards do not carry any kind of firearm whatsoever. If any prisoners do get into an argument, they're encouraged to blow up some steam in the boxing ring. The prison also has a spa and a gym, and there's even an arts and crafts room where prisoners make art. They then sell this to tourists for an income. Show us the actual and location prison, though, boy. Norway. We've already seen that Norway is famous for their very humane prisons. 
Well, how did prison has been voted the most humane prison in the world? They try to be as ethical as possible to their inmates, even when they've done very bad things. The atmosphere is very peaceful and relaxing. Prisoners are treated to hot coffee and good food. Their cells have mini fridges, TVs, and even private bathrooms. These cells are better than college dorm rooms or cheap hotels. These surroundings have very scenic views. And there are even forests where prisoners can walk around in nature. It seems odd to reward bad behavior as some of the inmates have done unspeakable things. But the reoffending rate data shows maybe this is the way forward. Hmm. Now it's time to make your voice heard. Comment below which was the most unusual prison in this video. If you want some the more amazing so cool videos, now then check out York. my second channel. But as always, thanks for watching. Yep. Please comment down below which one threw y'all off the most. To me, it was the one that was the oval one in the middle. I didn't understand. Are they only going to be able to see one prison at a time and they just roll them up one by one? Everybody else is in darkness? Like, what's going on? Them leaving the prisoners? I don't know. That might work for them. I'm not going to lie. I don't know. But let me know down in the comments if you know the names of these places. I want to do a video and try to see each one of them one by one if possible. Let me know down in the comments if y'all know the names. Also, let me know down in the comments if y'all ever been there. Know somebody that is there. You are. Let me know anything y'all want to. Let me know what y'all want me to react to next. Thank y'all for popping out. You are. Follow all my social media. I'm going to see y'all in the next one. You are. Peace. Love. Don't.